Rangers hosting the Dodgers, and both of these teams are minus 110 on the money line. The over-under is 9.5 runs. The Dodgers laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 143, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two. And the Rangers getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 170, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you'd win. They lose by one, you win. Neither one of these pitchers pitched against the opposing team either last year or this year, and it was kind of impossible for Heaney to pitch against the Dodgers last year, being that he was a Dodger. Um, the Dodgers have won Gonsolin's last two appearances. They are 5-5 five and five in his last 10. He's averaging 5 and a third innings pitched and 4.1 strikeouts per game. Generally, his games go under, but sometimes he's lights out and he can strike out a bunch of people, but usually it's in the 4 range. Now, the Rangers are 6-4 and four in his last, in Heaney's last 10 appearances. He's averaging 4 and 2 thirds innings pitched and 5 strikeouts per game in those games. Head to head, the home team is 5-5. Five and five. The Dodgers are 8-2 and two against the Rangers in their last 10. The favorite is 8-2 and two on the money line. The favorite winning these games by two runs or more, laying a run and a half, is 7-3. and three. <clears throat> There's only been one one-run game in their last 10 meetings. The over is 5-3-2 and two in their last 10, and the over-under at 9.5 runs is 5-5. Five and five. The last time they played each other was a three-game set in L.A., and that was in 2021. The Dodgers took two out of three. The Dodgers won the first game 12 to 1. The Rangers bounced back the next game and won 12 to 1. And then the Dodgers won 5 to 3. Now in their last handful of games overall, the Dodgers are 8 and 2 in their last 10. The over is 6 and 4 in their last 10. The over has hit in their last three games that they've played. They beat the Orioles. They lost to the Mets 2 to 1. Then they beat the Orioles 6 to 4. Then they beat the Orioles 10 to 3. And then they lost to the Orioles 8 to 5. For the Rangers, they are 7-3 and three in their last 10. The under is 6-4 and four in their last 10. The under has hit in their last three games, and they are on a six-game winning streak. They beat the Guardians 6-5, and then they swept the Rays in a three-game set, 3-2, three 5-3, and 5-1. This, uh, this is an interesting kind of game because eventually winning streaks do come to an end, and understandably the Dodgers are not the underdog in this one, which is probably why even though the Rangers are on a hot streak, it's just because they're the Dodgers. I am going to take the Dodgers with the money line. I'm going to take the Dodgers laying the runs and I'm going to go over. I Actually, I'm going to go under in this one. Let's just play it safe and go under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.